we're going to learn how to create a table such as this one three columns and three rows columns are vertical rows are the horizontal ones okay notice that there is a the header row is in bold and then we have the contents here which is a normal font okay the coding for table i have it here Okay, so this is this table that we see here. The code is like that. We have first a table open and close. Okay, let's uh, kill off this border first and um, show you what it looks like. Okay, so table open and close. Within there, we see TR is table row okay we have three sets here so we have three rows this table has three rows so within the table tag we have tr the first row and the contents inside tr second row of tr and the third row of tr okay within each row we will define the contents okay so within the first tr we have three contents here th open close th open th stands for table header okay as opposed to the next two which is td which is table data these are normal table data contents okay so first row we have the three entries cookies desserts and and pies written here and they are in bold signifying the header and then second row here ginger snap pandan cake apple pie just put a td table data okay, you put three and the last row chocolate ice kacang pineapple there you have it td chocolate td ice kacang td pineapple so that is how you do a uh, table okay that within the table tag you have uh, various attributes earlier we saw this border okay you can make a thick border or thin border or some people want border equal to uh, zero okay border equal to zero you have a table so the contents follow the grid but there are no lines border equal to zero okay or you can put a very thick border border equal to 10 and then you look at that so the border refers to the circumference around the table okay I'll just leave the border 10 for effect so you can see uh, the effect of that okay other attributes of the table we have something called uh, cell uh, cell spacing okay uh, so what happens when I put cell spacing equals to zero so if you imagine boxes small boxes within a big box and they are touching each of the small boxes touch each other so that means there's no spacing between the inner boxes cell spacing equal to zero but let's say if we want to see cell spacing equal to 10 very big spacing in between the little boxes that is cell spacing equal to 10 that is spacing okay one more attribute cell padding okay cell padding refers to the space between the contents and the edge of this inner box so what happens when i kill off the cell padding equal to zero then you notice that the contents will fit exactly inside the box compared to if I give a very large cell padding like 20 okay let's put 10 sorry 10 cell padding equal to 10 so you realize that the space between the contents and the edge of this box becomes wider so table you have border cell spacing and cell padding okay you can change the color let's say we want our header row this first row to be 
let's have some shading. So we do color equal to, let's say, cyan, which is a light blue, like a turquoise. Sorry, that should be BG color, background color. Okay, save it and then you can color a whole row. Or if you want to just color one particular cell, let's say pandan cake. Okay, pandan cake background color equals to green. So you can hit an individual cell or you can hit an entire row. Okay, and you can also merge cells. Um, let's say, uh, let's say desserts. Okay, let's say I only have one type of cookie, ginger snap, and I'll get rid of chocolate. Okay, we're going to get rid of chocolate. So if I get rid of that. Okay, you see there's something mess up here. So in order for that not to mess up, we want ginger snap to go through in and dominate the whole column of cookies. Okay, so you look for ginger snap, this item, put this thing called the row span. Row span equal to two. So we're gonna make this guy occupy two spell two cells across a row. Okay? Ginger snap. So this ginger snap spans across two rows. It takes up the space of two rows. You can also do a column span. Let's say this under uh, you have pineapple dessert and pineapple pie. Okay, want to uh, remove uh, ice kacang here. So let's make a uh, Let's make pineapple span column span, C-O-L span, uh, span two columns. Okay, so pineapple, this third row, pineapple will span two columns. Okay, and that's how you do the table.